Welcome to another GM Lighting instructional video. Today we are going to show you how to connect V120 RGBW tape to a DMX controller with a wired wall controller. The DMX decoder enables industry standard control without the need for Wi-Fi. You won't need a lot of tools for this installation. All you'll need is a couple of screwdrivers and maybe a wire cutter. Our installation today will include a V120 RGBW DMX decoder an RGBW DMX WC wall controller, our RGBW tape, which is custom cut at the factory. In this demonstration, we are connecting a 24 foot length of tape to the DMX decoder. We'll be demonstrating mounting in a V120 RGBW CHL4 channel that comes with a lens. This demonstration will show you how easy it is to connect. Remember, written instructions for this and other GM lighting installations are available at gmlighting.net. We can do this in four easy steps. Let's connect your V120 RGBW DMX decoder and wall controller. Step one, starting with the wall controller's GND terminal, we are going to connect the three wires from the DMX input to the wall controller. The green wire on the right goes to the GND, the black wire in the center goes to D positive, and the white wire on the left goes to D negative. Be aware of the polarity. In this case, black goes to positive and white goes to negative on the wall controller terminals. Step 2. We will connect the V120 RGBW tape. You'll notice when you unscrew the modular connectors that there are multiple terminals, each one for a separate lead. Make sure you connect color to color. Red would go across from red and so on around the connector. Using a small Phillips screwdriver, loosen the terminal screws and insert the color wire leads firmly into the small sockets. Tighten the screws and then rejoin the connector ends. Screw them onto the connector for a tight fit. Step 3. Connecting the AC input. This connects the DMX decoder to the wall controller's transformer. Connect the wires coming in from the 120 volt to this transformer. Step 4. This is where you would need to connect additional decoders to expand your system. The DMX decoder can handle up to 720 maximum watts. But for this demonstration, we'll use a plugged connector to terminate that run since in this example, we are only going to connect one run. That's all there is to it. Connect to 120 volt current and you're all set. Using the wall controller is intuitive. Consult the instructions that came with the wall controller to see all the ways that you can audition and program colors. If you want to add a V120 RGBW mounting channel, simply lay the V120 tape in, connect end caps, and overlay the acrylic frosted lens. This adds a soft, diffused glow to the V120 RGBW. Now how easy was that? To see other product and installation videos, go to our website at gmlighting.net. Thanks for watching.